What's going on Fantasians? You're watching Brutal Arc Mobile. I'm Asian Romeo and welcome to 2022's first Blitz week. We have an easy dungeon to run for day one. I will post the full December run of this dungeon in the link's description. If you want to go ahead and watch that, you can. But uh, in this one, we're just going to go for the premiums and the tech loots and the features. Without any further ado, let's roll on in. Before we fully get started, you can claim your February monthly loot drop if you're a Palmer Pass holder, so I'll go ahead and claim my one. Flak chest piece, we got a bear, a saddle, and bonus dies. Not that anyone needs die. Um, Let's see what stats this flak chest piece is, actually. Where is it? There it is. Ooh, so that's actually not too bad, guys. Um, you can get some pretty decent uh, decent armor, but sometimes it's not that great for the stats you get from the monthly loot. But anyways, guys, we have a tech shield, tech generator, pump action shotgun, and rex tech saddle. It is the Diamond Tunnels, replayed back from December. It is quite easy, so it shouldn't take us too long to uh, run this dungeon. We're just going to go right into it and head towards the Iguanodon room. Now, when you're in this room, um, be mindful. Last time there were uh, a leech or two in this room, so just... Yeah, keep a lookout, guys. You don't want to get um, latched onto. You are at half speed, so no point running away. I'm not going to waste time. I'm just going to go full front line and just shoot what I can with what I can. Also, what I found, guys, in the uh, December release of this dungeon is bow will actually do a lot better than a shotgun in especially if you can get a headshot you can potentially kill him with one arrow oh, damn wings you can't see with these wings like but anyways might take it off a bit later because it is i mean it's stylish but just not practical because you can't see where you're shooting reloading come on reload So just like the bow, your shotgun should be able to take it, take out two, two, uh, what am I saying? The bow takes two shots to kill an iguanodon, same as the shotgun, unless you have some serious bad luck. Bit laggy on the network side. Uh, can't even get a shot in properly. Come on. Nice. Come on. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. All right. Anyway, we are done for this room. As I said, we're just going to go for the important chest. So we're going to head up here for the... I think there's only one premium. Um, we'll go for that premium and the survivor's trophy and the facility key. But to get there, we have axical traps. We have a couple to pass to get what we want. Keep in mind, guys, that this week's splits, uh, we have reduced time on the initial clock. Uh, it is 30 minutes, it was 30 minutes on the previous dungeon in December, but of course we started off with 15, but not that it matters because that's still plenty of time to uh, take your time and get all the loots and all that stuff. No biggie that the time is reduced in half. 
Up around this corner we should have our first premium loot, followed by our survivor trophy. Uh, and it's a paver. This one here is our survivor's trophy. Yep, awesome. So in this uh, junction here, that's all you need guys, you don't need anything else. Well I don't anyway, unless you want just time added to your dungeon time or junk loot, but I don't want any of that. Because it is Blitz and you only have one day to fully run it, so... This here is or should be our facility key that we're after. Awesome, awesome. Okay. We are just going to make a beeline straight to the Daton room now, which is just uh, a couple of rooms off spawn. Nuh-uh, standing a bit too close for comfort. If you feel you're too close to these spikes guys, do step back, don't hesitate. Alright, so that's not spawn, that is the Guanadon room. I thought that was spawn for just a moment. But I do not see any leeches in here guys. Um, you might see some in your game. That one there? No. Maybe just this run has no leeches in that room, but there definitely were leeches, guys. I am not lying. Uh, this is an empty room. The room following this one is Daydon's. Ah, you down pig. Spawn on me. Freak me out for a moment. Where I was running to, he just had to spawn in front. I feel like my game's lagging a little, guys. I swear arrows usually does a lot more damage than this, because I'm burning through a lot of arrows just to get them. Alright, testing out shotgun. They seem a little powerful in this dungeon. Oh. Probably not wise to crouch and shoot because they are fast and you are half speed. If you can get somewhat distance on them, uh, good for the shotgun because you can get your shots off. But if they're, if they're too close, it just goes right through them. I'll, uh, I'll have to put some background music in because my game sounds just turned off on me and lo and behold my game's not lagging anymore what is going on with this with this device let's switch back to our trusty compo for this round just double check and see why oh that was a nice crit hit that's what I want to see Awesome. Okay, so we have one more round to go. Uh, don't have many arrows left. I don't even know how much I bought in with me. Let's see if we... Oh, a nice crit hit. 4k from that. Come on, give me a nice 4k crit hit. Ah. Pig made me use a lot of arrows then. Okay, so we need to go east now. We're going to go... Ahead for the next date on room, but um, the blah, the facility doors here. So I'll go past there and I'll quickly relog, guys. And we are back. You're watching Brutal Arc Mobile. If you missed out, we have just passed the facility door to the next date on room. There's a water room straight up ahead there. 
Now this room is not different to the last, except you can actually run away from them here. It is not half speed. Uh, I'm still looking pretty good, but I'm going to take off my angel wings because I'm actually frustrated that I can't see my target fully. Oh, they're just... These guys are fast too. They're, I'm going to try to keep my distance just a little bit, not too much. If I can get a decent damage output. What's going on, pigs? They're a lot stronger, that is for sure. My Buddha looks like today's game network connection is just not going to cooperate with me. Yeah, look at that jumping around the... jumping on the screen. That's due to my game sounds, guys. My device works absolutely fine without game sound, but then it's not enjoyable. One hit. Nice. Alright, so now we're on wave two. By the way, Fantasians, just off topic on dungeons, I am actually quite excited because I am going to be opening up a new server. I have already purchased it, but I have yet to make it public because um, I just want to play around with a couple of settings and test out um, the settings and whatnot. But I do, I open it up because I wanted to create a fan base community where uh, my subscribers and other public people who see my videos and they are really keen on joining my server that way this new server can uh, accommodate to you guys I will be joining that server as well so stick around I will make a separate video on the new opening of the server guys so if you are interested write it down in the comments and then let me know let me know if you want to join and you want to be a part of the community, let me know in the comments. My Buddha, these these pigs are so tanky. Uh, the shot two bows and it took less than 200 total damage. Or am I tripping out? Last wave, guys. I think I might stick with my uh, comp bow because shotgun, they get too close and it will just shoot through them. So for me, I'll stick it out with this bow. Wow, so tanky, 1k. Come on. Shouldn't be this tough, but it is. And it shouldn't be an ice dungeon for a medium dungeon, but it is. Wow, my bow's... N <laughs> it is not barely doing anything on you. What's going on? But I'm committed. No use changing out. There we go. Come on, make it easy for me, pig. Boom! How did that miss? That was right for the head. Wow, nice. 3k finish for the last arrow to the face. Alrighty, so now what we're going to do, we're going to head east again. Because that is where our Jug Artho and our Rainios are. Now, I recommend using a shotgun on on these centipedes because it will just kill them a lot faster than the bow does. 
I'm actually just using the bow because I was too lazy to switch back. Come on, spitter minions. Oh, they are low level. Okay. I might have to come back in and grab some implants, actually. Alright, so now we get our goody loots. This one should be a tech structure, tech generator, nice. Followed by North Loot, which is a premium gold collar. Yeah. <sighs> Brick paper. Uh, left Loot here should be another tech structure. Tech rep. Okay. Don't know why this dungeon would hold so many tech structures of the same kind. And I'll get this one here too because there's a water room and sometimes this could be a... Oh, okay. Bullets. Nothing good. Sometimes you can get a good blueprint or um, a premium item from that chest which is, you know, consumable pans and your dragon wings. No, uh, not dragon wings. Your aerial symbiotes. But unfortunately that loot there I just got should have been our featured loot but I got a crappy shotgun and a Kano statue that makes three total premiums in this dungeon that is all there is there isn't any more from here on we are going to mm, actually in the Arthur room down all the way down south is one more tech structure. So I'll go down and get that one. If you guys choose to go south from this room, there is a wall trap that you will need to pass. Otherwise you can go across to the Daydon room and then go down south from there for a no trap corridor. Ah, and this pattern sequence only just started so we're just gonna have to wait a little bit okay guys this one here is the official tech structure loot and we have a tech pillar from there which is which is cool but uh, nothing interesting um, also guys, I just want to make you guys aware, those loots, those other tech loots, you can potentially get um, uh, tech gear from there, if you're lucky. Yeah, okay. Let's switch out a couple of these armors before we enter. But uh, we have the Dung Beetle boss for this Blitz day. Shouldn't be too hard. What do we got? Survivor's Trophy. Got a paver. Got a couple of stuff, but nothing really exciting, guys. <sighs> I was hoping I'd get teleported to Noctis. But all good. Let's just give the boss a big beat down and then get our element that we deserve. Phew. Now guys, there's a few ways you can battle this boss. Obviously if you played for a while you know how to kill it, but just in case you can figure eight on these dirt mounds, just alternating between the two. Or you can get the dung beetle here and glitch him on the shroom. There we go. And as long as you stay in the one spot or just maneuver around him he should stay stuck behind there and you should have no worries at all but the fight does become quite boring but that's if you want a quick uh, quick and easy kill also guys wow bow does hardly any damage 400 to 350 damage and I and I think my bows what is my bow anyway we have a 
1125 damage bow and it's only doing a couple of hunch damage oh there he goes all good um we'll let you run away the other way you can fight the boss guys is obviously glitch him on the dirt mound where are you I'll wait till he comes towards me and then I'll chuck him into the mountain glitch. So if you stand up here, he will get stuck below. Easy to do, easy to remember. But he's nearly dead, so we're just going to stand here for the duration of the battle and claim our easy element, guys. Three forty-six damage shotgun, really. Uh, it does decent damage, but it could be a little higher. But anyways, okay. HP to go. Hopefully, this last clip finishes him off. Four, one point seven. Let's sort him off, guys. Oh, and the sword doesn't even do much as well. Anyways, lucky, lucky. So, we have an element, guys. There we go. If you ever choose to sword the boss, guys, get a lot of armor because, obviously, just then, it really did nothing at all. But, hey, day one blitz is now complete. I thank you so much if you guys have tuned in. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to like and subscribe. If you're an existing subscriber, just hit that like button. But anyways, guys, have a good day. Good luck on your element run. And I'll see you tomorrow for day two of Blitz Week. I'll see you all next time. Peace.